Oh, the prologue's done! Team Zero Escape presents! This is so badass. Wow, to think we have so much more to go. That was only the beginning, man. Oh, it's Brahmin. You are familiar with it? Yeah, I've been here a bunch of times. Ryuki is supposed to be here? I'm certain of it. So yeah, the other AI, like Slim Slender, has boobs, like nice slender arms. Aiba, just this fat piece of shit with stubby little TX arms. <laughs> Oh, man. Okay, let's go in. What's up, dog? Come on, Ryuki. Wake up. That's a lot of beer. You know Mizuki's not playing with that bullshit. There's no way she's drank a sip of beer yet in her life. She just has no tolerance for this dumb shit. There's no way she does. Oh, look, a porno mag. Unfortunately, that doesn't seem to work on Ryuki. No! It just makes me so homesick for Dante because you know it would work for Dante, man. Makes me so sad that he's not here. I suspect Date would have woken up instantly. Oh, I know, I, I fucking know. My former partner, Konami Date, is a collector and lover of porno mags. He loves porno mags more than anything else and revered them deeply. He often said, The Big Bang happened when God opened a porno mag. But this epitome is a sin. Uh, but this epitome of a sin is no longer with us. He has passed on. We lost a great soul. Rip. Nah, just kidding. Except for the part about the porno mags. <laughs> oh, man. Come on, big brother. Wake up. Wake up. Oh, my God. She's trying it all. She's pulling out all the stops. And Mizuki, she knows. But I immediately would have been up at these past two, without a doubt. If you don't hurry, you're gonna be late. <sighs> Oh, sister complex. Sister complex works. He's awake. Iba shook to the core. Nurse, for some soy sauce, <laughs> honey, please. What kind of kinky role play is this guy into? What? What? Right down the middle. What? <laughs> They're gone. Where to? I don't know. Maybe to the mirror world? What? Geni, being this man? Full name, Gen Ishiagane. Wow, he is an interesting character. I met him several times in the past when I was in Date's left eye socket. I never met this damn man. Yeah, Geni is the owner of this fusion restaurant, Brahmin. He runs it all by himself without hiring any help. Hmm. Where could he be? It's not like him to leave his customers like this. Jin Furoe's other half was found. The other side of his corpse. The one we couldn't find six years ago. The time of his death was around 12 o'clock today. What do you think that means? Answer me, Ryuki! 
You were in charge of the HB case, weren't you? <sighs> Make it a side part, please. Ugh. Just what kind of dream is he having? How should I know? Should we try wink sinking? Forget it. It'd just be oh, a waste of battery. Wink sinking, because they both have freaking robots in their eyeballs! Dude, what a clever little way to uh, kind of be like, wake the fuck up, bitch. Ryuki, please tell me about six years ago. Just ask him tomorrow. Mizuki can't wait. Again, she doesn't understand. She she uh, she she gets that he's intoxicated. But she doesn't see that as an excuse as to why he cannot answer to her right now. Grow the fuck up, get the fuck up, and tell me what the fuck's going on. That's all her brain says. There's no way she will leave this guy alone. I want to know all about what happened back then. The HB case and the explosion are related. If I can solve the HB case... Maybe I can figure out where he is. Now, I will say, I guess she doesn't fully understand because if you expect somebody at this level of intoxication to, like, <laughs> coherently tell you exactly what's going on, then you're a little dumb. Like, obviously, this guy's not going to give you good info. So, like, yeah, you might as well wait till tomorrow. I'll take a double shochu curry shot. On my dick. <laughs> This is futile, Mizuki. Ryuki's blood alcohol level is 0.32%. He is quite intoxicated. That is... That is quite high, yes. <sighs> In fairness, the reason he's like this now is because of that incident. He had psychological issues before, but the events of the case deepened his condition. As you can see, he now spends his days drowning himself in alcohol. Well, that's sad. So if we solve this case, we might be able to heal his trauma? It's, it's, it's a good way to look at it, Miyuki. It's possible. God, she's so blunt, man. Then it's all the more reason for him to help. Like, she just, like, she will tackle the physical obstacles immediately without question. For his own sake, too. Still, I doubt he would wake up even if you cut his eyelids off. What will you do? Isn't it obvious? Isn't it obvious? I swear, like, if there is one quote that can, you know, reign over the entirety of every game this developer and writer and scripter and director has made, it is this quote. Isn't it obvious? God, it is just so implanted in my brain. I'll never forget it. Hearing Fly say, isn't it obvious? I'll just never forget it, man. I'll just never forget it. I'll sink with him. No! Oh, I fucking knew we were gonna sink, dude! Let's go! Oh, wow. We're just going to Abyss HQ and we're gonna sink with him? Like, but he's not even consenting to this. It feels a little fucked up, to be honest. But I guess we're going, dude. I guess we're just going. We're just doing it. Oh, I'm actually excited for our first sink. It's just been so long, man. Oh, I remember this music, though. It's a classic. Like, look at this. This is just pathetic, man. Nothing has changed in this facility in the past 10 years. What the hell? Mizuki, hi. I think you're wasting your time trying to talk to him. He's so soaked in alcohol, you could light his breath on fire with a match. Also, Pewter! Yay! Yeah, he's just alright. Good to see him again, though. I'm gonna keep talking to him, though. Yo, Ryuki, get up! Uh, careful, Mizuki. If you wake him up now, we'll be the ones mopping up the mess. <laughs> he slumped over like a bent nail. I guess that's why they call it hammered. Ryuki is completely plastered. Yeah, where's Boss? Wait, you didn't see her at the stadium? I did, but she's not back yet? 
Of course not. This is Boss we're talking about. She's probably at a host club in Kabukicho, licking the salt off her third tequila shot right about now. Dude, everyone's just an alcoholic here. I guess, you know, when you, when you work in a field that's so high stress and, you know, you hold the fate of, you know, societies, you know, you, fall, you hold the fate of society in your hands, you know, you just kind of uh, cope with alcohol, I suppose. His real name is Futa Amananoa. But everyone calls him Pewter. Like the city. <laughs> like me, he's a member of Abyss. A genuine engineer who manages the sync system and other machines. He's also Iba's creator and takes care of her maintenance. Ew! That means every time I fall in love with Iba, I just have to remember that the person that made her is this stinky, smelly old man. Does that mean that Iba is technically female or male? If a male makes a female robot, are they male or female? Let me explain some things I've put on hold. First, we'll go with Abyss. It stands for Advanced Brain System Squad. I actually did not know that. They are organi uh, they're an organization created to use the state of art technology to investigate the insides of the human brain. During criminal investigations, it's commonplace to talk to suspects and witness to gather information. Oh, this one's long. But some of them uh, stay, stay mum or have disabilities. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Or are too traumatized to speak. What should we do to those people? Go in their heads. It's like sinking, actually. Sink into the deepest parts of their psyche and interact with hidden secrets. We call this sinking. The sinker, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, I mean, we got it. I know. I got the report. Jin Furaway's right half was found in Studio Divitas six years ago. The other half was found at the stadium today, correct? But the corpse's estimated time of death was around 12 today. No signs of the body having been frozen. And Jin doesn't have any twins. God, every time I fuck Iba, I'm just gonna think about fucking Pewter in the ass now. The theory of the right and left half <laughs> belonging to different people was debunked earlier, too. What do you mean? We got the DNA results. The DNA extracted from Jin's right half six years ago. The base sequence was an exact match with the left half that was found. A 100% match. They definitely belong to the same person. The right half was found six years ago on February 10th. Today is also February 10th. Huh. What could it mean? Mizuki, do you really intend to sync with him? Would it be a problem because he's drunk or something? No, but what I mean is... You haven't gotten permission from Boss, have you? I understand how you feel, Mizuki. Do you think of fucking a girl's mom while you're going down on the girl? No. But when I was fucking my girlfriend at the time, I was kind of known as like a lollycon a little bit. I was I was like 18 and I was I was like sort of a lollycon, you know, again, I in my early stream days, you know, I touted being like a lollycon, ha ha ha. Um, and yeah, my, my girlfriend at the time was like 20 and she had a sister that was 18 and she like, you know, was like more flat chested and stuff. And because my girlfriend knew that I was like a lollycon, she would I don't know if she was actually self-conscious about it or what, but she'd be like, you probably prefer my sister's body over mine. And uh, when I was fucking her, I did imagine her sister once just to kind of like, you know, like just kind of like think about it. You know what I mean? <laughs> Is that fucked up? Maybe. But, you know, that's how I can relate to your question. There you go. I'm sure you want to solve the HB case more than anyone. <laughs> That's my deepest, darkest secret. Now you all have it. After all, you lost two very precious things due to that incident. Date, of course, and... You know, if it... 
Oh god, yeah, okay, yeah, she doesn't have an eyeball. That's that's supposed Your to be normal. Eye. Just kind of scared me a little bit. Okay, but like, it it wasn't a great thing to think about, and I immediately wiped it from my brain. Okay, does does, does that clear me from from some of the bad doing? At least we didn't have to extract your eye to insert the AI ball. I just like wanted to know. Like I just closed my eyes and thought about it. Okay, I was just curious, man. Like humans get curious. There was nothing left to extract. I am glad the room was vacant. I don't do well with roommates. Listen, you shouldn't delve too deeply into this case. I have a very bad feeling about all this. Don't worry. Boss didn't technically give me permission to sink, but she did assign the investigation to me. Yeah, I don't know if we actually know how Mizuki lost her eye. I, I don't remember, at least. But yeah, in this route, obviously she did. Are you sure about this? Yeah. There will be no turning back. I know. I see. Then let's get started. What happened six years ago? Ryuki's memories may hold the answer. Oh my god, here we go, dude. Here we fucking go. Come on, lift me up. Yeah, there we go. Equip your VR goggles. We're sinking, bitch. Mizuki. The time limit with insomnium is six minutes. Stay there any longer, and your consciousness will be absorbed into the subject's mind. I got it. This isn't my first time sinking, you know. Okay, then. Let's begin. Damn, all of a sudden, the, uh, the lip sync, like, was really accurate there and fast. It's like 60 frames per second lip movement. All right, we're going in, man. We're going in. Before all that weird stuff. <gasps> what? Hard to take you. Never let this mess in this world erase you. See the, 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 the torch to guide you. And the, 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 Okay, she gave the abridged version. I know the lyrics perfectly, but she chopped it up. I've been practicing. How's my dancing? Oh my god, Iva! Oh my god, I can't believe she just did that to me. I literally cannot believe she just did that to me. That's why I fucking love you! But what's really, 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 really interesting about that is... Does that prove that Iba knows of the good ending in the first game or is she just you know you know copying the dance moves that she saw iris doing because this this that was iris's dance that's like one of the dances she does in her live streams so i don't know if it's a reference to her or if it's a reference to like no nah, like i know the ending i don't know <laughs> but interesting oh my god that song touches my soul so deeply we gotta listen to the whole thing at, like later for sure yeah looking good wriggling around like a freshly caught shrimp oh no not you too i'm too cute to be a shrimp i know i hate when people call her a shrimp too hey listen now's no time for a dance number we have an investigation to handle oh yes my apologies i felt compelled <laughs> i'm so glad you felt compelled iva god i'm madly in love with you yeah, Date used to call her a shrimp. Oh, Mizuki. Do you know your way around Somnia? If you are assigned to this case, you will be sinking many times, I'm sure. Would you like a refresher? <sighs> I mean, it's like super simple, but I guess I'll take the tutorial. Yeah, sure. A little refresher course couldn't hurt. Not that I need it or anything. Understood. I will be ready to assist you when the time comes. Insomnia. You will investigate inside the dream. The objective will be to find the subject's hidden memories. Got it. Thanks. Uh, that, 
Do not tell me that was literally the entire tutorial. There's no way. All right. Then. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Are you fucking serious? <laughs> this desk and camera are from the interrogation room. But there's no walls or ceiling. What am I supposed to do in a place this bare? Well, before anything... Somnium scan! Activate! Classic 999 sound effect. I'll never lose it. We got three mental locks. Okay. Dispel Ryuki's hallucinations and find the truth. Ryuki is trapped by hallucinations. Help him overcome them and discover the truth. Okay. Hmm. This layer of Ryuki's somnium appears to have three mental locks. So I gotta unlock those, right? Correct. By doing so, you can travel deeper into his psyche. The truth is found in the deepest layer. By unlocking mental locks, you can go deeper into the dream. By unlocking them all, you may be able to learn valuable information. The way to unlock mental locks are called objectives located at the top left of the screen. Make sure you make your way towards them. Okay, I'll start with this room first. Okay. Look at Miyuki's facial expression right here. It's cool. I like it. It's like a little fucked up but good right there isn't much to interact with but there must be a way to continue insomnia you can inspect things with name plates first move Iba around and interact yep still can do the most important thing insomnium happy to see it Oh my god, I love Iba so much. Okay, um, sure. Let's look at the two-way mirror. It is the same two-way mirror as the interrogation room. Due to the lack of a wall, it appears to be floating. When inspecting something, you can give Iba orders. Break the mirror. Who is the most beautiful person in the world? They both cause zero time. Okay, this is like mega tutorial then. Um... So yeah, for, for those of you that yeah haven't watched the first game, you're essentially yeah picking different options to where like you think that it's a, a good choice that will somehow in a roundabout way discover things about you know the person you're syncing with. So it's all like very abstract, but sometimes you can sort of deduce stuff. I know it's going to be me, but ask anyway. Mm-hmm. Mirror, who is the most beautiful person in the world? And like, of course, we're gonna pick this one because, like, come on, the fan service. What? It's me, Kagami. <laughs> come on, man. Come on, you're really gonna do that to me? No, it isn't. <laughs> it's me, Kagami. Wow. It is a two-way mirror. Let's do it. Huh? It went through. Oh no. My head no! Oh my god, she's an amputee! I have like a fear of amputees. I don't know what the word for that is, but yeah, like, I oh no! It's okay, she can still be my waifu. It just. Oh. Iba, you okay? Just kidding. Oh, okay. Ugh. Sorry, sorry. Anyway. It appears that the mirror will not break. I hate having a, an irrational fear against amputees because, like, it feels so, like, discriminatory. But, um, I don't know, man. I always have. It, like, just really, uh, I don't know. I don't know what it is. I really, it's very hard for me to look at people that are, that are amputees. Like, really, really, really hard. Five eyeballs gained. Ga gained. Can I speak? Um, I can use those to buy outfits, so cool. All right. I guess this is how you obtain them. A folding chair. Same as the kind in the interrogation room. I mean, let's sit down. Let's interrogate. Try sitting on it. There. Oh, what? Ryuki, 
Mizuki, now is your chance to question him. Now? He looks absolutely rinsed. You can check how much progress you made through the depth chart. Yeah, we got it. Tell me about the HBK. Slap him awake. Appeal to his emotion. Appeal to his emotion. He's broken, man. Ryuki, I am sure your mother, watching you from heaven, doesn't want to see you like this. Okay, so he has lost his mom. Just let it all out. It will make you feel better. This isn't working. We need to ask him more directly. Don't make your mother cry, Ryuki. You can atone for your sins. And when we are done here, we can visit her grave. How does that sound? I think you're enjoying this way too much. <laughs> yeah, like, how does Ivan know all of that? What the hell? What is key? Huh. Um, what? I cannot get out of this menu? What? Okay, apparently it's not coded in the controller to get out of that menu. Thank God my keyboard allowed me, because I have not saved at all! Definitely should save. Good reminder. Oh my God, man. If, if, if I couldn't get out of that... Oh my God, my life just flashed over my fucking eyes. Okay. Mizuki. You cannot get away with this just because you're a member of law enforcement. According to Criminal Law Entry 195, Special Civil Assault, you can be punished for abuse of authority. Chill, we're in a dream. It's fine. <laughs> hmm. Well, at this rate, we won't get anything out of him. Wake up! Oh my god! <sighs> fine. Wow. It. Guess I'll just do what has to be done. Jesus. Iva, that's enough. You're violating criminal law in 195. <laughs> Dude, this is a No, no, no! My my leg skipped it. I was going to say I, I want to leave it running. That that's a YouTube video in the making right there. 1 hour of Iba slapping uh Ryu Ryuki. I'm telling you, I I might make that into a YouTube video and just have it fucking on repeat, man. That that is such a video right there. Ryuki, can you tell me what you know about the HB case? <laughs> Why do you keep making me remember? Damn it. Damn it. I was so close to finally forgetting. Please. Are you okay? Yeah, it just got really bright. What was that explosion? That blue thing. Is it an eyeball? Hmm. Ryuki, do you know the culprit? Do you? What is this? Wait. It's a reverse sync. What? Ryuki's consciousness is flowing into your brain, Mizuki. What? What? I was just thinking about that. Because, like, Mizuki's doing this sync and going into somebody else's brain. I was like, oh, this is cool because, like, she's done this before at the start of the other game. And it's like, no, she never has. The person getting synced on never has any agency. And I was thinking about how weird that is, and now we're literally doing it. Oh my god, he's in my shit! This is... This is Date's room! This is where Mizuki lived! No, dude! Oh, we're gonna go through Mizuki's trauma now. But also, first time we get to see Tama. Let's go. Damn thick mama. She, uh, she looks like a, a kill a kill character, man. Mr. Date's house. More like Tommy Mommy. Holy man. Gee, mother of God, she's wearing a G string. A thong. Huh. 
What is this? Soup? No, we're talking about the culprit of the 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 DB murder, correct? B B B D, whatever the fuck. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Intrusion thwarted. What the hell? That's probably an end game. We've defended against <clears throat> Ryuki's consciousness. Yeah, so because there's timelines in this game, we're probably gonna go back to that point when we actually know, and that'll be one of the uber late game timelines, if not final timeline. So is everything okay? It should be, but it is peculiar. Usually, the sinker goes into the subject's mind. But for some reason, the subject's consciousness was able to slip into your mind. I'm a little curious though, because if we picked that, we would definitely know. It would be like locked, and then like you know take you out. 100%. That's what would have happened. We're definitely going back there. But you should be fine now. We have blocked the root of intrusion. We are reconnecting to Ryuki's mind via another path. Dude, oh my god, dude! Look, look, look at uh, look at Iba's curves in the window, bro. I like that pose. What makes her ass more prominent? That's good. But why did that happen? Mental lock was unlocked. There are still others. This place is... It's the cathedral. Oh, so this is what you were talking about. Hey, is that rubble? It appears as though the collapse was halted halfway through. Oh, it's Ryuki. And my boy's not looking too good. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Really makes me feel like he knows a lot more than he's letting on, though. Like, what the heck? How Let's is go. he involved? Wait, Mizuki. You can only remain insomnia for six minutes, 360 seconds. Wow, for some reason, when you say 360 seconds, that sounds so much shorter than six minutes. Is that just me? For some reason or another, the passage of time in the interrogation room was slower. But that is not the case now. Okay. You need me to find the info within six minutes, right? I got it. While I remain still, time almost stops. But time progresses when I am in motion. Here we go. Okay, now we got real game mechanics. The training wheels are off. That's the system that Pewter came up with, right? I swear, that Pewter is like a tech god. Thank you, XCon! That's the system. The way Mizuki said that, she really, like, meshed her words together. I feel like that should have been a re-recorded line. <laughs> That's an interesting way to compliment someone. Anyway, if you are stuck, that's stop the system and observe your surroundings. Look at the map it and is try the system. to get a hold of the situation. Understand? Yeah, yeah. Thanks for the reminder. Go ahead and check that "Don't display this message again" box. Wow. I don't have that function. That's <laughs> that's horrible. Iba pissed. Yeah, we're good. Okay, can we save real quick, though? Like, I really want to save. Okay. Cool. I actually didn't think that I could save Insomnium, but I can. Oh, it's so weird how time, like, moves as I walk. I really forgot about that mechanic. Um. Okay. Um. Let's go to this button. What? You can't press that? I guess I have to go to uh, Ryuki then. 
What's this? Oh, we're surrounded. The rubble turned into a hand. Ryuki's dream sure is creepy. Spooky. Darn. We cannot get through. We need to find a way out of here. A brazier. I can interact with this for whatever reason. I mean, I'm just gonna breathe out. I mean, I feel like that's 100% the answer. It is not getting bigger or smaller. Really? Blowing on it didn't make it waver either. Is this fire real? Yuki's dream is trapped by the shadows. The shadows are... Mizuki, I have obtained a key. What's that? A key is a new function that Pewter came up with. It uses an algorithm to clarify the rules of a Somnium world or the sync subject's psyche. In other words, it tells you how the dream works? Correct. Damn, we can do that now? Pewter's legit. Dang. The sync system has evolved greatly. The key can help with unlocking mental locks and better understanding the subject. By searching more, the key will be updated and information accumulated. So the more I search, the more hints I get. Key is a clarification of Somnium's rules. The star of a sink, it is hidden. They will open when you inspect things. These are crucial to reach the depths of Somnia. When stuck, try checking them. In the lock info, you can find the objectives keys. Insomnium, open the lock info to find more clues. Ryuki's dream is trapped by the shadows. The shadows are... Huh. So how, how do I get to that? I don't know. <laughs> okay, lock info. Got it, got it, got it. Okay. Hi, right, good night, Natsuki. It was fun to have you. Take care. It's a torch. It's on fire. Uh, do you breathe in. We are a dragon. Breathe in what? The torch, duh. The dank kush. What do you mean, duh? That wasn't an obvious answer. I want you to extinguish it by sucking in with your nose. What? I have never heard of such a thing. You'll never know till you try. Fine. Huh? Ah! <laughs> I had a feeling that wouldn't work. Oh man, why? Why would I choose the dumb option? Because I just assumed that it is it, like it was, the dumb option was the right one. Why? Ryuki's dream is trapped by the shadows. The shadows are always missing a single aspect. Huh. Okay. It's a torch. I mean, let's try and breathe it out. Wow. I could do well as a street performer. That looks fun. I'm gonna try that at home. Please don't. I'm kidding. Blowing it out won't work. What is Mizuki, happening? You have five minutes left. Huh. I mean, these are the these are the only two things I have as, as options. No. Is inspecting really going to do anything? It looks like a normal brazier. Touch it. No. Please, come on. Just a tip, please. Why? Why the fuck would you say that, Mizuki? With that smug fucking grin on your mouth. Okay then. Like if that e if you're that eager about touching the tip, then at least make it mine. Jesus. Hot or not? Hot or not? So it's fire that's not hot. A dating app that swept the nation in the early 2010s. Maybe early 2000s. Shit's old as hell. This fire must have shadow traits. The fuck does that mean? Shadow traits? Different properties from the real world. For example, consider fire that is not hot. It is as though it is missing a property that it has in the real world. These shadows 
are usually heavily affected by the nature of dreams, so we might not extinguish this fire in the usual predictable fashion. Well, valuable intel, but like at the same time, what other options do I have? It's a torch. It's a normal torch. I can feel the heat of the fire. Okay. There is nothing different. Oh, I see. <sighs> what? A brazier. Sure. Let's breathe it in. If this brazier is a shadow, we can't extinguish it in the normal way. I feel like normally they don't do that, where a new option appears after you inspect. Um, feels a little bullshit, but uh, that's cool. Uh, you know, it is the dream world. Nothing makes sense. Let's do it. Breathe it in. Let's try something that doesn't normally extinguish fires. All right, suck in really hard. Great. I do have amazing suction. And no teeth, though. Remember that part. <laughs> what the fuck? What? Amazing suction. Bravo! Bravo! Marvelous. Marvelous! That's exactly what Dante said in the fucking first one! Amazing suction! Bravo! Marvelous! That's exactly what he fucking said! Go back and rewatch my one video that I made in um memoriam of the first game, because I fortunately I didn't record all of it. Um I remember. I remember specifically, Iba is playing with a doorknob and she goes book 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 and after like multiple times she gets blown away. Amazing suction, bravo, marvelous. Oh, let's go, dude. What a callback. And this is exactly what she looked like. But now, now with the lighting, it looks like Iba isn't even wearing panties and it just looks like her fucking vagina is literally out. Huh? Indeed. Looks like the shadow traits were the key after all. Interesting. So we've already taken a, a different um, branching path. That's so interesting that there was another one that was even available to us. Hmm. That rubble there. Is that lower than before? Again, this is when like things start to get super fucky. We are already on branching timelines. Like somebody else playing the game right now could 100% be on a completely different route. So, uh, yeah, that's crazy. We're, we're already on a different path from everyone else. Do we have another time limit? If we do, we cannot be wasting time. All right, let's chase after Ryuki. If you get lost, use the map. Yeah, I know. Yeah, 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 sure, sure, sure. Map. Just, I'm actually not looking at up uh, Iba's skirt, contrary to popular belief. I just wanted to kind of look around at the area a little bit. Doesn't this look awesome? Okay, I may have taken a peek there, but I, I promise you that was not the intention. You have four minutes remaining. Okay, 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 okay. Hey, Ryuki. It's not my fault. Please forgive me. Damn it! We are trapped in this space again. But if we get rid of something with the shadow trait, maybe we can get out. Ryuki is blank. He's still holding on to blank and blank. Huh. Right or left? Left, always the An answer. Revolver is floating. That's, that is Date's revolver, I believe. I mean, it's possible that, you know, Ryuki also uses it, but... Shoot Ryuki, shoot yourself, inspect it. Jesus, I, I, I could never choose either of those options right now. Let's just inspect it for now. It's an Evolver. Standard issue for Abyss members. Is it Ryuki's? Unless there is a special request, all members are issued the same firearm, mm. so we cannot tell. 
But there is one thing I notice. What is it? I do not feel any electromagnetic forces. What is it? The Evolver utilizes electromagnetism, so it should be emitting electromagnetic waves. Oh, maybe it's one of those shadow trait things. Perhaps. Oh, yay! I got a tiny! It's so cool how they use the, the, the colors um, with this first Somnium sync already. Like, we also get to just see Iba green instead of red. You know what a tiny is, don't you? Um, it's like a useful item that changes the flow of time, right? Yeah, I was just thinking about these. For the most part, Tiny is a material capable of modifying the way the brain processes time. By using this, you can slow down or speed up time in the Somnium world. I invented it! You go, Pewter! <laughs> you cannot hold on to too many at a time, so be sure to use them as they come. Three, I believe. Um, yeah, I mean, essentially, it's just a way to, like, do time save. So, yeah, okay, so we have one timey that makes any action we do equate to 10 seconds. So, of course, you know, if there's something that takes 20 seconds, 30, 40 seconds to do, might want to use it. Hands holding a bottle of brandy. Floating bottle of brandy. Wow, this shit is crazy looking. Again, not looking up her panties. It's a bottle of brandy. Um, Jesus Christ. What the fuck? Why? Why would someone do that? <laughs> okay. <laughs> this is scary, man. This is scary. Um, okay. Well, let, let's just inspect it first. We'll also get a 20 second timey off of it, so might as well. Hmm. It looks like a normal brandy bottle. Is this Ryuki's favorite drink? Yes. I've seen Ryuki drink this brand before. Ryuki was drinking right before the sink, which is probably why it showed up in his dream. He's just a drunkard. I do think Ryuki has a reliance on alcohol. Though it is all mental, it is not easy to overcome such an addiction. You don't have to sympathize with him, but you should at least understand. Damn, Iba. Speaking absolute factual statements here. That's why I love her. I see. Hmm. It's Brandy. It's Brandy. Hey, it's Brandy. Um. Hmm. Um, okay. Well, yeah, using the 20 is going to cut either of these in half. I guess, uh, let's puke. I think it will, um, I don't know, maybe activate something in his memory that, that shows us a bad day. Why do you want me to puke? I thought it might help you remember when Ryuki puked. Mm-hmm. Uh, I can try. So, anything? No, though I am starting to taste something sour. A couple of cogs fell out. I bet you can taste sour. Anyway, this is pointless. I do not want to keep trying. Ryuki is blank, and he's still holding on to his regrets, and... Three minutes left. You can do this. Damn, we're really not doing a great job here. Um, I mean, I don't want to use the revolver, man. That's scary. It's Brandy. It's Brandy. We'll give it the 10-second timer. <laughs> if you say so. <laughs> oh my god, look at that face. Look at that face. Look at that face. Wow, that's how you're gonna drink it? <laughs> Woo! Oh, I'm feeling good. <laughs> it's me, Iba. <laughs> you okay? Mizuki, 
Can you pet me? Yes, 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 yes. Look, 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 look. Head pets, head pets, head pets, head pets. Pet you? Pet me! Pet me till I explode! Iba's bugging out. If you don't pet me, I'm going to self-destruct. <laughs> okay. Three, two, one. Iba, you're scaring me. Get a hold of yourself. She got it. She it all. Uh, my head hurts. Oh, stop yelling. She's just going through the whole cycle, man. Jeez. I should have never told you to do that. Yeah, dude. Alcohol sucks, dude. Ryoki is burdened by what happened in the past. He is still holding on to his regrets and... Alright, well, at this point, I think I did everything with Brandy. It's Brandy. It's Brandy. It's Brandy. Are you Brandy? I guess we have to use the Evolver now. I mean, come on. The, the poor boy is suffering, man. I'll shoot myself first before I shoot him. Which method do you want to try? Inside the mouth? Below the chin? Or on the temple? That's horrible, man. I don't want to make that choice. I don't even know why I made this choice. I mean, I do, because, like, I don't want Ryuki to get shot. But, like, how is this going to help Ryuki? I don't see how this is going to help at all. Um, and also, I hit the skip button by accident because I put the controller on my leg. My god. Um, you don't have any second thoughts about this? The hell? I do. But my job is to support you, Mizuki. Above all else, I believe in and obey your orders. I, I see. Thanks. Okay, on the temple it is. I think it is probably the most dramatic. Eh, maybe not. I don't know. I think it is. You, you know, you just see, like, the crazy face. <sighs> yeah. In that case, can you ignore my last command? In the mouth is almost, like, sad more than anything else. Because um, I think that's usually what people would choose, you know, in, like, a zombie apocalypse or it's like man they just gotta go you know what i mean it's like man dude yeah just like i have to choose death chin is like i think kind of in the middle side of the head is just psychopath imo what the Iba! Iba! it was a blank my ears are ringing oh my god if you shoot a blank in your temple like that, it I still feel like that may fucking kill you. That sounds horrible. <sighs> Jeez. Your nose and ears have been through a lot today, huh? I have other holes. I'll be fine. That come on now. Come on now. Yeah, holes that I can't touch. Fuck you. Even though I really want to. What were you planning on using the other holes for? Uh, Mizuki, come on, please. What are you fucking twelve? Obeying your command was the right thing to do. Good job, Mizuki. Well done. Wow, I kind of didn't really expect that to work. Oh, uh, yeah. Glad it worked. <sighs> I see, because he has contemplated doing it exactly this way himself. Ryuki. <sighs> Damn it! Damn it! God, imagine actually having a gun authorized to you like that. Ugh, that's scary, man. I'm sure many cops have uh, have had situations like that where they literally put their own guns to their fucking head and then end up not doing it. But, like, the fact that you get driven to that point is, um, is scary and sad. It's really unfortunate because, like, you know, policing and cops, like, man, dude, a lot of them really are, like, not a lot, but, you know, th there's a handful that fucking suck. And, um, and there's a lot of issues with, like, the police force in general. But at the same time, there are a lot of good people in there. And um, it's really sad because it's obviously such a thankless job um, due to everything else. So, you know, my heart really does go out to um, to the, to the well-intentioned cops out there that are really just trying their best to, to make the world a better place. That's no use. Me dying isn't going to fix anything. 
Are these feet? What the fuck? Why, why is that what you're commenting on first, you freaking weirdo? What are you, out of foot fetish or something? I can't die yet. I'll carry this forever. Get Ryuki. Ryuki is burdened by what happened in the past. He's still holding on to his regrets and is in denial. Let's chase after Ryuki. Oh man, that's so cool that this area has opened up. Oh man, what a cool area. This again. But now we know what to do. We need to find the thing with shadow traits and break it, right? Yes, most likely. But it looks like we can only interact with Ryuki. Ryuki looks badass in this, like, inverted color area. The green on him looks great. Retry try allows you to go back to the mid-safe point. Yeah. Hey, Ryuki. I can't forget about what I did. I have no future. Heaven. Well, considering I beset it, um... I'll give it a go. Boys love it when you do that. Boss told me. <laughs> no! <laughs> pet, pet, don't be so hard on yourself. Quit being so shy. Put your heart into it. Hey, come on, Iba! <sighs> Fine. Pet, 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 Well, it looks like the petting did, uh, not so much. Hey, Ryuki. I'm sorry. I'm an idiot. I'm really sorry. I have to live with this for the rest of my life. My god. This guy's fucked, man. Um, I'll inspect. Oh my god, I but come on now. <laughs> he has a scrawny face, but it's a Ryuki that can be found anywhere. Found anywhere? There is nothing wrong with him. So this Ryuki isn't a shadow. Ew, very valuable inspection there. Ryuki. I did nothing wrong. I forgot it all. I'm going to enjoy the rest of my days. <laughs> yeah, this sounds more like a shadow Ryuki to me. Um, I kind of want to just like own him, dude. Good timing. I was getting annoyed. <laughs> oh, you seem enthusiastic about this. Get a hold of yourself. Huh? Didn't connect. Mizuki, you have less than two minutes left. Be careful. Okay, thank you. I appreciate it. Wait, what? Is this another one I can interact with? Oh, no. Okay. I did nothing wrong. I forgot it all. I'm going to enjoy the rest of my days. <laughs> Jesus. Uh, yeah, sure, bro. You're, you're fucking crazy. You're, li you're literally insane. This Ryuki doesn't have a shadow. And something's weird about how positive he is. That must be the shadow trait. So we should do the opposite of what he wants. He looks like Midoriya Izuku. Look, it, it, I know that like it's the hologram green popping out of his face, but just like squint your eyes and imagine that that's actually green hair color, dude. It's Midoriya in the flesh. Yes, the don't encourage the psychotic breakdown plan. Ota would probably love the praise, but this is Ryuki, the honor student we're talking about here. Good old Ota, man. I can't wait till we meet him again. Ryuki, you're doing well. Just forget it all. You did nothing wrong. No one's going to resent you. 
boss and everyone else accepts you. Just rest. Take some time off. Enjoy yourself. N no, that's not... Stop! It's all my fault! Which is why I needed to do something. All right, our plan worked. No, 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 no! No forgiveness, no mercy, never! Never! We're going, man. The fire. There's no going back. What is Ryuki holding on to that's hurting him like this? The last correction selection will allow you to go over the 360 second threshold. Even if you run out of time, don't give up to the very end. This police ID is... Huh? What? I feel like it's like Date's or something. Ryuki! Because like, Date is his superior, he looks up to him. I feel like he is involved in what happened to Date. That's... Possibly. Uh, I'm sorry. I didn't think this would happen. Okay, this is some Obito Kakashi shit. Blood. Blood. Let's get out of here, Mizuki. There has been a lot of fire and explosions too. It's it's definitely related to Date in some type of way. Hmm. God, that looks beautiful. All right, rubble drop it is, man. Here we go. Branching path, determination, let's go. Uh, <laughs> I want alcohol. I mean, I think it goes pretty well with the script, but I'm gonna avoid it if if I can. It's the middle of the night. Um, who are you again? It's not bikini. <sighs> it's not zucchini either. Oh, I remember. It's Mizuki. That is horrible. Ugh. Looks like he hasn't sobered up yet. Yeah, we do not want to deal with this man. I'm not leaving until you give me answers. So quit messing around. You probably weren't listening to me at Brahmin, so I'll say it again. No need. Tama told me earlier. Jin Furue's other half was found. But the body was alive until noon today. You want to know how? It's simple. Jin's left half flew here. It flew through time from the world six years ago. What are you talking about? Ryuki, I looked inside your mind. I know. You synced with me, didn't you? Why did you say it that way? Who was that person? That person? The person who was reaching out to you at the end of the Somnium. Tell me, something happened six years ago that I don't know about. What was it? You really want to know? You really want to know how I got these scars? Yeah, tell me, Ryuki. Yeah. You could be putting yourself in danger. I don't give a fuck. I'm not afraid. Fine, then I'll tell you. But I'm sure there's no need to explain what happened on February 10th, six years ago. Yeah, I was there, at the studio. Alright, then I'll start from the part you don't know about. 
the day after the incident, February 11th. Hmm. 